supermarket. Oh. <laughs> So this is the supermarket in Antigua. That's Crystal. <laughs> and she's dying. It was in here. Oh, she's in here. I was gonna say, but should we do the one with garlic or not? No, garlic be too much sometimes. Oh, let's do the one with lime. Oh. The one with lime. We came to get our little snacks and then we got some bubbly. We don't know what this is, but you know, we're going to make it work. <laughs> Supermarket out here, they have bubbly. I've never tried this and I've wanted to try it. Caribe, Caribe. Caribe Momosa? Girl, we have to get two. <laughs> have arrived to our little villa 22 B&B tour got the living room TV cute little kitchen so cute then you come over here got the bathroom it's so nice cute bathroom and then we got one room. Mirror. And then you come out here. Ooh, this is so ooh. This is so nice. No grocery haul. And plantain chips. Pineapples, strawberries, chocolate, these Caribe mimosa shit. Oops. Some chips. Damn, that's the only kind of chips. You doing a bad job. Put that shit right here. I did. I said, look, I, was, I don't care about these because I don't eat jalapeno. Some Prosecco. Another Prosecco. Some lotion. And Madeline's waters. Hey y'all, so we just landed in Antigua. And look at our view. This is from our balcony. So we're sitting at an Airbnb, as you guys on the Airbnb tour, where we got these little ca Caribe Mimosa. It's um, orange and pineapple, and it has 6.9% alcohol, and it's actually really good. Y'all, look at my tan. I'm so tanned. So, it's actually my cousin's birthday today. But I just took a shower, and I just kind of throw something on, because we're hungry. So I think literally like the beach is right there and they have like a lot of restaurants. So low key we can like walk. Cause they don't have Ubers here which is kind of annoying. And it's like, I might to call a cab just to go five minutes. Like I'd rather call it like coming back. Cause maybe we can get it from like one of the restaurants and shit. Um, but yeah, so this is day one. And then it's heat wet, it's so beautiful. Like, like, what? So y'all, 
With so a little straight. light. Oh. Y'all look, I have to use a whole flashlight because they got no street lights in here. And we're just out here walking like nothing. And these guys were in a car and they were like, hi ladies. Did you said hi cutie. Oh, see, I thought I heard ladies because it was two different cars. But so hey guys, <laughs> guys, we out here like in the middle of nowhere. Literally, like we're surrounded by the wilderness, and I don't know if you guys can hear, but there's creatures all around, <clears throat> and we just happen to get to a street where. There's actual lights, but we didn't show you on the way down from our Airbnb. I wouldn't have seen anything anyway because it was so dark. <laughs> it was so dark. And Crystal wanted to come back because she's a little punk. Um, but then these people you that are in front of us. Way. No, like, so they could see you. Oh. Oh. So how do I flip it? You gotta pause it. I just stop it. Chicken, mm -hmm. for my bread, mm -hmm. some jerk pork, mm -hmm. and one more one. Look at him being for my 17,000 followers. On TikTok. Yeah. Good morning, you guys. So it's the next morning. I just got up, wash my face, put myself together a little bit. Mm -hmm. So today we're going to Stingray City. We're gonna go um, swinging. I mean swimming with the stingrays and we want to try to go to roti king first it's like this little like it's not like a restaurant restaurant like kind of like those like pop-up places whatever but last night y'all last night was something so we went to this restaurant called anna's on the beach that's like it was a 20 minute walk from our airbnb but y'all it was pitch black i brought a knife for me because i'm like it was like you know like in country in other countries they don't really have street lights, so it was pitch black. But thank God, like we saw this other family, so we like trying to stay close to them because they were going the same way we were going. So we went to Anaheim Beach. The food, busting. We had the seafood pasta and the 
Dickinson, babe, which is like a mixture of like seafood. Bussin, everything was bussin. We got a free shot and free drinks because it was our birthday. Um, and then the waiter and his friend, I think he was like the bartender. Um, they were they were getting off probably like an hour and a half, so we kind of just like ch stayed chill chilled with them. And then they took us to smoke smoking something. It's a lounge. Um, smoking smoke. I don't remember. It's a lot. Oh, signature smoke. We went there. The music was good. The vibes were good. They get up. They got us um free shots and a drink. And then we ended up leaving. And we went to like this place. I guess I don't know if like that's they know them or like whatever. That's their family. But like, then I literally like I recorded. He literally opened up the little bar for us. It was crazy. So we had did that. And then we went to like this little stand that sold um for um jerk chicken and pork. Um, like a cute little like shop. Like a not shop, but like a pop up store kind of type thing. I, I recorded it so you guys saw. So that was so cute. So, yeah, so today um, we're gonna go swim with this thing, raise. That should be so much fun. I'm excited. So, I will catch you guys later. That is so cute. Got the pool. Oh, shit. All right, we could bring my tripod. The sun is popping right now. Look at this view. We made it to Stingray City. We have to get on like a little boat to go to the actual like place and we have some time to kill. We got here early. So we're gonna see yeah. yeah, this sun is shooting, not a cloud in the sky. I love it. And we got our tanning oils on. We're gonna get dark out here. Hi, chicken. Anyways, what you should do, and what you should not, so listen up very carefully. In my hand I have a perfect example. How stingrays are shaped, they flat in shape. We are both male. So please double one of your hats, caps, covers, everything that's live. Also at the front of the boat, the live graphics are located. So in case all of the emergency will be used up. What do you have in your hand? Please, oh, oh my god! <laughs> 
Once they're feeding, they're going to touch it. Don't jump. Keep your feet down. Don't jump. Don't jump. That shit was... Go. Okay, what the... And if it hits you, right? Oh, it is. A, he was showing the vagina. The nose has two pieces right here. Okay, the two. Yeah. And that, instead of this and that, and the males, they have two pieces right here. So they actually don't like it. Wow, they have two? Yeah, they got two. Just blessed. Is that the male? No, it's a female. The males have class? Yeah, the males have class. That's what we got into. I'm not scared anymore. I realize that. We got two, two, two. What's the two, two, two? Two, 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 two. Uh -huh. You know how that room is? Two, two, two. Yeah? That room is mad enough for us. Where, who's, who, where is that? Where do you go room two, two, two? You're crazy, man. Where is that? Give it a kiss to get one more. Oh, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> I want a, I want a video like that. No, no. Give it a hair. No. Right there, go ahead. No, no, no. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> some, some rum punch. Got a little drinks. Trying to figure out what to do now. We're looking for our driver. Irby. Oh. Hello. 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 We got this chicken sandwich from Show them the KFC. Where we at? Oh yeah, I recorded it. Oh. Right, I'm gonna take a bite. Oh man, yeah. we got chicken. But I think that's the biscuit. It's not have a beat. Mm -hmm. G, come tell the camera. I have two minutes. We can't the shot script and then we leave you. Hold on, hold on, hold on. We got to work. We got the phone call, yeah. We're about to take some shots. You didn't put the light on. Uh -huh. See the boys. You got a flashlight on your phone? Yeah. That's you then, know. Is that me? Yeah. Well, I'm going to do this. We got to take the shot script and then... Ready? Mm -hmm. Cheers. Salut. Cheers. Salut. 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 This a feeling when my god baby I only joke Might not good with words But my new for fuck I want me in a yummy glum on my ass Got my hundred miles just to spend some time with you yeah. I'm with a drive hundred more miles Feeling sure you're good I want me to know you're good Alright, we got Ziggis and Baby Ziggis and Baby Ziggis and Baby Ziggis and Baby I'm not going to be able to do it. I'm not going to be able to do it. I'm not going to be able to do it. I'm not going to be able to do it. I'm not going to be able to do it. I'm not going to be able to do it. I'm not going to be able to do it. I'm not going to be able to do it. I'm not
something in the morning. Luckily they still have food things open. So we're still gonna eat the food is so so far the food here has been like ten out of ten. Every day. Ten out of ten. Well, yeah we haven't done breakfast yet we keep missing breakfast. Maybe tomorrow we'll catch it. Because we need tomorrow. So but yeah we went to the beach we're in the city right now. <laughs> We're going to Jolly Beach and then we're gonna come back to the city because I wanna get like souvenirs and shit. And um
Being sure you're good, I'ma know you're good. Being for the pussy, cause I know I'm dead, so you be that. Take your pussy from me, like, see, I'm a pussy. And if they ever fuck your man again, you pussy. But don't tell us what this is. Stay cool ice cream, number one on the island. Thank you. Take a look in the back. You see how Chair Rocks look like now? This is the local rum punch and the local rum on the island. Oh. So it's our last day. We at breakfast, brunch. Well, it's nine in the morning, but we gonna call it brunch because we have a mimosas. We didn't even get to go out last night. We were just I've been asleep since like eight o'clock yesterday, so we didn't even get to go out. We didn't get to experience some of the other like clubs and lounges here, but well, we went to Jolly Beach yesterday. That's um, a big thing you guys need here is cash. Definitely, like you need like, depending on how long you're staying, you need a lot of cash because like 85 percent of the island just takes cash. So, and they have ATMs, but they be charging like eight dollar, five dollar fee. So make sure you have a lot of cash over here for sure. I'm so oh my god, this is delicious. Damn, I gotta do it again because there's a motherfucking fly. So I'm to take. Hey you guys, so I just wanted to come on here and end off this vlog because I didn't end it and it kind of just ended abruptly. But I got home Christmas Eve, today's the 26th. So I just want to say like I've been to like eight or nine countries and like and Antigua is definitely like my favorite so far like it's it's up there like for sure for sure I just love the island it's more like reggae like Caribbean vibes like real Caribbean vibes I I love Caribbean countries especially the ones that are like that like because I love my reggae music soca music like dance hall like, I love all of that so it was just perfect on the island the island is so green like they don't they have houses but it's like very minimal and it's like on the poorer side they do have like you know the nice places um but like it's like all green the water is like teal blue like you can see in the water it was just like the food was amazing like literally this trip 10 out of 10 like nothing bad happened literally 10 out of 10 and we literally met this driver i'm gonna well we met two of them but the second one we ended up meeting him the first night the first one ended up taking us from the airport to the bnb and we stopped at the supermarket the second one we met him the first night when we went to go eat and we kind of just stuck with him like the rest of the trip and he was so cool like he was showing us around his name is irby like i said i'm gonna put like their cards so if you ever go like definitely hit them up he was so cool he was showing us around everywhere he would stay with us um at some places like you know just to like make us feel like safe and stuff because i will say if you know caribbean men or if you've been to caribbean islands they're a little bit aggressive so if you're not used to that like me like me and my cousin we're like we're from new york like we're used to like men throwing themselves at us you know so if you're not used to it, just know like it's and you you know you're a pretty girl just know it's gonna be a lot of that out there but i kid you not like we barely paid for anything the overall is not expensive antigua is not expensive their currency it's ec so a dollar here is two like 275 ec something like that so it is a little cheaper over there and they do take american dollars but i will say like i mentioned earlier in the vlog you need cash like 
I had to take out cash and that wasn't even enough. Like, we just had to take out cash like twice. You need, not this girl peeing. I'm... Anyway, you need a lot of cash out there. Like, a lot, a lot. But it is cheaper, but I would say depending on how you how long you're staying, if you're staying, let's say five days, I think 500 is good enough and that's well more than what you need. Like it's very cheap out there and like the prices are reasonable and for the food, you get a lot, the portion, like everything was just so good. Like I can't say nothing about the bad about the trip. Um, so yeah, definitely cash, you need that. And also too, like if you're a smoker, if you like to smoke weed or whatever, that country is like, they're high in that. I don't think it's legal. I think they said it's not legal or it is legal, but you can have like a certain amount. So if you smoke, they smoke heavy out there. And I think they have dispensaries too. Um, with this Stingray City, we went to the clear kayaks, but the only thing is that the pictures were a separate charge. So I'm thinking, okay, maybe it's like 40. Cause you know, like if you do excursions, usually for the pictures, it's like 40 extra, but this was a drone because it is in the sky. And it was like seventy dollars, so we were like, "Damn!" So we didn't do it. Um, we didn't get to check out a lot of the lounges. We checked out Signature Smokes. We went there like every night, um, and then we like were hopping. But Signature Smokes, they have like a balcony, like an outdoor area. That was a very like lit um, lounge club. No, it's like more of a lounge vibe. And they have hookah there. Um, Another one you could check out was Vice, JR Spot. We were gonna go to Vice our last night, but we ended up falling asleep. Um, and yeah, like it's just so much to do. Shirley Heights, we didn't get to go. It's kind of like a cliff type thing, and they have like a restaurant and a pool. It was just so much we didn't get to do, but we do want to go back eventually. But like, y'all, like 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. Like, I absolutely love the trip. I would definitely be going back soon. I just love everything about it. The Airbnb was great. The host was very responsive. I'll leave a link to the Airbnb we say that. Um, the guy's name was Marco, the host. It was just a great trip overall. Like I'm so sad to be back in New York. But my tan is popping though. Like, you can't tell too much, but my tan is popping. But I'm so sad to be back and I'm a little sick because the weather changed and I was away for 10 days. Like I went to DR first. But this vlog is probably going to go up before my DR vlog. But I went to DR first for my birthday. And then literally next day, same night I came back next morning, I flew to Antigua. So I, I've been in the tropics for 10 days, literally. So now I'm back in the cold. I have like a stuffy nose. But it was all worth it. But yes, I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. If you have any questions, like let me know. And I'll be glad to answer anything. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoy. And definitely check out Antigua. And I'll be like, I sent you. Especially like you go to Irby, the taxi driver be like, I sent you. Anywhere you go, I sent you. Or be like, you found them on my YouTube channel. Hope you guys enjoy, like, comment, subscribe, and stay tuned for my next video.